Microsoft. Island builds Microsoft. Shall we see the insider trades on Wall Street trades on NVIDIA? And look at that. 17 million, 11 million dollars, 7.6 million dollars, 7.5 million dollars. I mean, it's a lot of money on the table. And guess what? Bullish, 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 bullish. So you get a bit of an idea of where the market's positioned, right? The market's thinking, cha-ching, it's going to keep going up. And these are all short-term trades into early April. So the market is bullish. That doesn't mean that the market is always right, but Wall Street is definitely bullish. People with quite a lot of money out there. Microsoft, teeny tiny pullback here. You know, it just got cold and things shrunk. And overall, though, we are above the 50-day moving average line. So we are positive. We just kind of keep moving up. What's the resistance for this coming week? Actually, there's quite a lot. Let me just... Microsoft's a very heavily traded stock. Okay, actually, the, the support is probably a little easier to find, and it's here at 410. That's our support. And that is that big red bar there. It also coincides with the 50-day moving average lines. It's kind of a double support. On the way up, we're at 420. It's going to get harder here at... 425, 430, 435, 440. And that's maybe why we're just not really going anywhere because there is this, this zone of resistance between 420 and 440. And it's just, it's, yeah, it's actually really, I'd call it, I would call it a resistance zone. You can't break through it, but it makes it harder to break through it. So, if you're at bullish trades open, you might need some patience. You might need to get that time value to kick in before things really, really get going. Shall we have a look at what um, our lovely, dearly beloved friends on Wall Street are doing with Microsoft? Let me just take off some of these tickers here. What do we have? We have NVIDIA, PayPal, and here we go. The largest trades, $1.8 million, $1.6 million, and so on. I mean, that's still a fair amount of money. Top four trades are bearish. And they're selling, what are we trading at? 420. Well, they're selling call options that are pretty much all making money. So you could also just say they're just taking profits, but it's definitely a bit of a bit of a bearish indicator in the short term that people are taking profits. And that's what I'm saying is happening here with these calls. So the big guys make money, and then they close the trade, and then they force some selling in the in, in the stock, which is why we are.